This tutorial demonstrates how to process holiday pay in BrightPay and record annual leave taken by an employee on their calendar. If an employee is due holiday pay in their current pay period, simply select this pay period on the payment schedule bar. From the employee listing, select the employee's name to access their pay slip. Under Additions and Deductions, click Add, followed by Holiday Pay. Enter the holiday pay amount to be paid. Please note, the holiday pay amount due to an employee is not automatically calculated by BrightPay and thus must be entered manually by the user. Once all the employee's pay data has been entered on their pay slip, simply click Finalise pay slips to update the pay period. The employee's pay slip will now reflect the holiday pay. Alternatively, should you wish to prepay an employee or employees their holiday pay in a current pay period, simply access the payroll utility. Within the current open pay period, click more on the menu toolbar, followed by prepay following pay period. Select the employee or employees you wish to pay in advance and click OK. In the current open pay period, click the on-screen alert, go to following period. Enter the employee's payments, additions, deductions, etc. as required in the prepay period. Should you wish to pay an employee or employees more than one pay period in advance, within the prepay period, simply click More again on the menu toolbar, followed again by Prepay following period, and simply repeat the same process. To finalise your prepay periods, return to your current open pay period by selecting this on the schedule bar. A confirmation message will appear to state that this is a prepaying pay slip and will confirm the future pay periods that will be included on the pay slip. Simply click Finalise Pay Slips to update the current pay period as well as the prepay periods. A prepay period will then be indicated by a clock symbol next to the employee's name and any prepaid period will subsequently be blocked from editing when this is selected in the payroll. In the event you need to amend or undo a prepaid period for an employee, simply click Payroll and select the pay period in which the prepaid pay slip was included. Select Reopen pay slips on the menu toolbar, tick the employee in question and click OK. Now select the prepaid period you wish to undo on the schedule bar and click Undo Prepay. Click Yes to confirm you wish to undo this prepaid pay slip. The prepaid pay slip is now undone. To record an employee's annual leave, simply click Employees, select the employee from the listing and click Calendar on their menu toolbar. Next, select the annual leave date or range of days on the calendar. Select annual leave from the listing of leave types offered on the right side of the calendar. The selected day or date range will be flagged accordingly. BrightPay will then keep a track of an employee's annual leave entitlement based on the annual leave entitlement method chosen for them. An employee's annual leave entitlement method can be set within the employment section of their employee record. For employees whose annual leave entitlement method is one of the following, based on a set number of annual leave days, based on number of working days, accrued by number of hours worked, set hours per day excluding overtime, or accrued by number of hours worked, set hours per day including overtime, part days can be allocated by selecting the applicable date on the calendar and using the dedicated option to the right of the calendar to adjust accordingly. For employees whose annual leave entitlement method is one of the following, accrued by number of hours worked, irregular hours excluding overtime, or accrued by number of hours worked, irregular hours including overtime, part hours can be allocated by selecting the applicable date on the calendar and using the dedicated option to the right of the calendar to adjust accordingly.